Hello guys, I'm back again and this is the final paw. Oops a daisy. <laughs> right, I've mixed up my resin. The same resin, Jan Shun. I'm nearly down to the bottom of that resin. And all I need to do is pour for this and then we'll go on to something else. Let's see how we do. It only needs a very, very thin top layer. And that looks as if it's actually above where it needs to be. There'll be a few things above. So I'll just give that a bit of a sand while I'm here. I don't want to be overdoing it too much. I'll soon, soon clean it up. Right. That should be okay. Methinks. Now then, carry on pouring. I look forward to doing the next one because the next one at least I'll know what I'm doing. So oh, I'll change hands so that you can see what I'm doing. I know I'm only pouring but that, uh, that flower's going to be above. I definitely should have put some things on the base before I... Uh, Before I put the sand in, but let's have a look, see if we can get this spread. If I if I can doom it slightly, hopefully it'll go above the flower in that. We'll see. I don't want to overdo it. mixed 400 up. I thought I might just need 200 but I thought well if I mix 400 if I've got any left then I can do something else at the end with this only only being the uh, the final layer. But I think I might use it all up. <laughs> Take it easy. Take it easy. Now I might have to tip it that way a bit because it's it's domed at the front and low at the back. It can't be a very flat table. It must have warped at some point. I want it to be as even as possible. in there. Go on, that's it. 
that's it. Go on. No, then. How are you doing? Um. Can't really tell if it's uh, domed on the back. Let's have a look. I don't want to get my hair in it either. So I want it to go that way, that way slightly. So, fingers crossed, put that in there and put that under there. Fingers crossed. All fingers crossed. Everything's crossed. Everything's crossed. I mean, see this, the flower is still above, so I don't know what I'm going to do about that. I don't want to put too much in because it'll go over the edge. Has it already gone over the edge? No, that was yesterday's. I'm just going to have to bite the bullet and file that down because it's the only way, only way I'm going to deal with that. I can push them under the water, hopefully. They should be okay. Yeah, that one's okay. Pull it down a little bit, that one. Yeah, I can push that one under the water. So there's just that. Oh, I don't want to break it. But bit of resin left. That's as much as I dare. see loads of bubbles in it but hopefully they'll bring themselves to the surface bit by bit um, hmm. yes my next one's going to be a lot simpler than this to get a load more stuff. And there it is switched on. Oh, how do I change that? Like that. That looks all right. Now then, where's the legs? Now then, what can I do? I need to free up some space, so I'm going to put a 
a puppy pad on the floor. I hope this is going to be all right. I don't want to end up spilling any anyway. Please, 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 please. Straight away, over you go. will get pinned underneath eventually. Just bear with me guys, I'm just going to do some more bubbling, debubbling. I'm going to take, take you off here and excuse a minute so there's the table there's the table come up and over and oops there's the top Oof. I did the wrong way around there, didn't I? Didn't I, guys? Right? I hope you've seen that okay. Just pop you over there. Ah, it's not much, but I can make something. Let's have a look. Get some more... Uh, Goth, uh, goth earrings made. I hope everybody's well. <coughs> Had a lovely visit at my mum's and she'd... Uh, She brought out some homemade soup for lunch. I had some vegetable. And my mum had some carrot. Oh, and it was absolutely delicious. Just with a cheese sandwich. And a little parmesan uh, sprinkled over the top. It was lovely. Very enjoyable. Should encourage myself to... Uh, make some soup I've got to see about getting my cooker fixed stood idle for so long four year old I've been here four years and I got it as I was moving in so yeah it's four year old whether the element's gone on, t on it or what, I don't know. I'll have to find out. Because I'm silly not using it. Fair enough, I can't peel vegetables, but that doesn't mean to say I have to stop altogether, does it?
not much. for the bottom. Right. <sighs> right. This got out of the way. I'm still looking for some uh, vases so that I can do a, a pour over a vase and then do a, a nice a nice picture. Now where did the black go? I've still got it on the top here. Possibly still have it on here. Let's have a look. Oh, there it is, yes. Nice big pots. I love the big pots. Brilliant. Just the sticky side. I don't know how many this will make. Maybe two two pairs of earrings, if that. Now I've already done the pentagram. I've done the lightning strikes. I've done the cross uh, in the uh, circle, so I'm going to do some different ones. A bit of this. Not too much. See how that is. Anything sparkly. I love a bit of sparkle. A bit of colour and a bit of sparkle. That should be adequate, I think. A little bit on the top of the top of the popsicle stick there. Get that in and mixed. I am going to try to do a few more shots because uh, a lot of my vlogs have been over an hour long lately and uh, it can be too much sometimes. Now then, this is going to be awkward because, although I can make, uh, yes, I can, instead of earrings, I can make the... Uh, the pendants with them. 
if I want to make the earrings with them I'm going to have to get another mould so that I can do them together oh there's a black hair lily again it's a bit of a mess Excuse me. Adrenaline rush. Right, let's have a look. Micro brush. Try to avoid the bubbles. Right round the outside. Sorry, I should be using my other hand. You can definitely see bubbles. We don't want that. Clear off the top. I don't think I'm going to fill them totally. Because sometimes I think they can be a little bit too thick and cumbersome. So I'm just going to fill them to the nearly up to the top. brush around the around the top oops don't want dribbles centerpiece round all the points try and get as rid as as many bubbles as I possibly can if not all Right, a little bit more in that one. Oh, 
length I'm cutting them on the neck it doesn't really matter about the thickness does it it's just if you're making them into earrings I don't think they need to be quite so thick How far up is that? Hmm. Reasonably far. Oops, not too much, not too much. One or two. Uh, the sun, I'll do that one. Can you see it okay? I hope so. I'm going a little bit too fast for my liking. about getting it right into the point. Come on, up you come. Oops, not too much. about it. A bit more in. We've got quite a windy day out there, but at least at the moment there's no there's no rain. I think that's just nicely domed. Now then, the eye. This is going to be a right doozy. This one. I'm gonna go in between with the uh, the micro brush so that it dampens every part with the resin and then hopefully when I pour the rest of the resin in it'll go straight to the, all them points and not uh, not leave any bubbles behind.
because if anyone was going to have bubbles it in it, it was going to be this one with it being so so detailed. and some resin in now. Hmm. It's hard to get a tiny little tiny little thin stream gone round there. One big bubble. I sorted you out. Right. Let's see before that drips. I'm going to have another one of them, I think. Nearly there. Just leave it slightly dawned. It always looks a lot neater if uh, if the backs are domed rather than flat. I think so anyway. Let's see if that's enough. Mm, a tiny, tiny bit. Just to add to that dolmen. That should do it. And I think I'm going to go ahead and top this one up as well. Don't overdo it. Slower you go, the more precise you can be. Oops. I think that's perfectly domed. I think I'll do that one again.
it didn't look as if I had much resin left, but it's surprising how far it goes. Thank you to all my uh, subscribers for sticking with me and anyone that uh, enjoys watching my channel, please like and subscribe. I'd love to have you on board. Sometimes I might uh, make a total hash of things but that's part and par of uh, creating things there's always mistakes to be made nobody's perfect I think that bit's dumbed enough. Right. Get this star out. And I'm almost coming into my craft room every day at the moment, which is absolutely brilliant. I have to keep that motivation up to keep on coming because as soon as I stop, there'll be a gap where I don't do anything and I don't want to get into that, uh, get into that frame of mind because it's not a good place to be. You just get lazy. But there's so much encouragement out there when people do like and subscribe to your channel. It's a great piece of encouragement from people. Great. Now then, wow. Let's see if I can get another pair of uh, lightning strike earrings out of it. Looks as if I might. Don't pour too fast. Hey. I'm going to be able to finish this whole board, this whole tray. Wow. Brilliant. Now then, just deal with the bubbles. These micro brushes are so, so handy for popping the bubbles. Or if you need something a little bit more delicate, you just take the... Uh, furry bit off the end 
and you've got like a almost a needle point to go into delicate areas which is really good I can see some bubbles around the outside now, I, I normally do this before I fill it right up so it it will look a mess at the moment. <laughs> right, let's have a look at this. Around the outer edge. And then round the little, the little point. Big bubble there. Huge bubble. Still there. Get off. It's gone. Good. Right, it's got a big bubble in the end of that one. Come out, come out wherever you are. Bubble there. Any more bubbles anywhere? I don't want to touch that one. Is that a bubble? Yes. I didn't want to touch it, but it looks as if I have to. A daisy. Need quite a bit of a clean off. Let's hope I get no bubbles in the the cross in there. I could possibly put a bit more resin in that one because. It's not as domed as the other ones. Very little left. I think I'm just going to be finishing it, finishing off in these. Oh, it's getting very thick as well. Come on, down you come. This resin does not take long to start to thicken up. I mean, it's already thick to start with, but... You've got to be quite quickly. Quick with it, I should say. Quickly. Let's have a look. Okay. 
rid of that a minute and get that. So what are you guys up to today? What amazing things am I going to see when I turn the telly on later? I wonder if... Uh, Miss Frances is going to do a live tomorrow? I'll have to have an afternoon nap though because if I don't I won't be able to survive the whole uh, the whole live because it's way after midnight when I see it. I think this has worked out rather well with the amount of resin I had left. There's a bubble. It off. Do I try to squeeze some more down on that? Probably end up taking it back off again but right domed domed reasonably domed All you beautiful subscribers out there, if you've got any ideas of anything that uh, I could make, I'd love to hear your uh, opinions. I really would. I might be uh, going on to do a, a bit of a vlog, not about my life, but a little bit about myself, so you can get to know me a little bit better. I mean, nobody wants to know... All my troubles and what I've been through. And I don't certainly want to uh, bring them up because I've put most of my past behind me, thankfully. But there's things that I dealt with on a daily basis and... Uh, For people to understand what I might do, what I might say sometimes, because I've got no filter. It can be a bit awkward sometimes. 
especially at this day and age when you have to be politically correct. I'm not racist in any shape or form because I think people on this planet are all entitled to be here. They've all got the same rights regardless of where they come from and what their beliefs and faiths are. I won't get into a debate about that either. Like I say, I'll probably just talk about myself a little bit. it will give you a better understanding of the person that I am. I think I've done all that I can with this now. I've just... That needs scraping off just a tad. Far too much on there. Oh, looks as if I've got a bubble right in that corner there. Good job I saw that when I did. Now then, scrape off the middle slightly. not supposed to be on the eye that much. Of course this will all get, uh, it'll all get trimmed. Right guys, that's it for now. I hope you've enjoyed that and I will see you in the next video. Bye.